Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are back with The Walking Dead. And yeah, so last episode someone we found out that someone was working with bandits, trading them the good stuff, as Lily said. Then Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. Um, On foot, maybe Lily can't really afford died. to do that now. Just shot her. This seems like a safe area. Oh, this brush will Carly stop anything from creeping up on us. Carly wouldn't. Carly wouldn't. I know that for a fact. Carly is too nice of a person to. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Might have been stealing, because I don't... Stay close to Kenny. None can, of them okay? would have. Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, no, I think Duck's a bit or... dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. So we've got to... But I don't know how we are going to get it. I don't know. So Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Water. Yeah, I'll go get that for Duck. I'll take this to catch you. For Duck. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. So, can you to Savannah? There's gotta be a better way to do this. Yeah, Lee, you're not getting that off. Shit. Oh, that's broken. Broken. Okay, um. I'm gonna give. Uh, catcher. Some. Found this in the boxcar. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well... I don't, but you're probably right. Well, Duck's dead, basically. Duck's fucked. Monkey wrench looks like it do more power in its sleep. 
This even looks like it'll break easier. I don't know. Probably just maybe me. What's in Searching everything, but I don't know about trains, really. And, um, Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Uh, monkey wrench. Wait a minute. Oh, he's already dead. Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. I don't know where he's dead. That's unlucky. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. Yeah, I, I don't think. The light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. Oh, it works. We're going to have a train now. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Man, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Okay. Man, this could be exactly what we need. We need a train. What's this? No this, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Maybe I could do that sketching shit that Clementine did earlier. I forgot what was it called. Um, she had a leaf under the paper, sketched over it, and it did an outline. Jesus. Oh shit! So maybe I could do that if I had a pencil. Does that wait? Oh. Pretty sure there was a pencil in the RV. This door's gonna hurt. Okay, you aren't gonna like this. Come on then, motherfucker. Come on then, motherfucker. Again. Damn. Animal crackers, I can give them to duck. Or I can eat them myself. I'll, I'll give it to Duck, because... Poor kid's bit. There you go, catch him. Here, I found this. If Duck's up for it. Thank you, that's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you. Ah, she was a sure. Adam's full on kid. Okay, I need to go to the RV before I forget those a pencil or a pen or something in here. There we go. A red pencil. Next to a uh, tub of banang. Okay, um, notepad. Let's go, come on. Come on, Lee. Fucking power walk this shit.
Merit file. Come on then. Perfect. You can read it now. So what's yeah, mute? Should be PC. able to just follow the steps to get the engine off. Sounds good. Okay. Two down, three up, one down, one up. So six here. Three down. Three up and then one down. Oh fuck. Last one. Up. Son oh, of shit. a bitch. Whatever you did, let the dash up. So far so good. This one, um, Okay. Just turn that one to the side. Now we're talking. And nine. Nine was outside. It was this one. Pretty sure. I can't remember. Yeah, number nine. It was. Left, right, okay. Y, and then press X. Holy shit, we got a train now. Holy shit, we're golden! There we are, golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Okay, Kenny. Let's take a train. It's all yours. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Okay, okay, I'll go do that then. No oh, shit, got hiccups. Not hiccups, just gassy, I guess. Fucking hate him, Cleveland. I swear, like, we had lockdowns about COVID, then we were back in systems and shit. Still had COVID system about. It's gonna be a better way to do this. Oh, shit, wrong one. And then out of the blue I've got fucking COVID. There. Hey Kenny, we're loose. He cannot hear us over the fucking train. Touching my stuff. Oh shit. Who the fuck are you? I took your map and your water. I took the map of the train routes. That's fine, you can have that. Really? Yeah. I got them all right up here. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Hello, Charles. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself I shot to do you. it. It's still kind of freaking me out. Brain folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Okay, Chuck. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. I want to say something, but you know. We don't, but. Mm. You Custom have sweets. candy. Boy, I got the last piece I got on me. Figures. 
You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. We should get Duck a spliff, bro. I can offer y'all whatever I THC. got, although it ain't much. <laughs> Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Okay. Oh, and he plays guitar. That's lovely. Oh, fucking tired. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Come on, Kenny. Looks sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Don't you fucking speak to Clem like that, bitch. Kenny, I love sicker. you. Let me look at it. Well, stop it. Yeah, yeah, you see now, you see now. I'll stop it. We can't ignore this. Look at the kid, Kenny. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it were, what can we do here? Get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. We're going to Savannah, okay. Child's dying. We can't ignore it. Let's start this thing. Get it up and running. I feel bad for Kenny, man. Well, yeah, his son did die. Well, we got bit and is dying. We've lost the motel, we've lost Carly. In the matter of two days. But Kenny didn't really care about that, so that's not very much. But Duck is dying. We lost the motel. We lost everything we scavenged for. So that lady dying for Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. Ben, why do you look so mad? There were more of us. Dad, get him? No. Ah, living got him. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. <coughs> look, can I... Could you just get that off his face, please? It's hard for Kenny. He's losing his son. But... He's out of time. We need to stop he this train. To, okay. He needs to stand up. Please. Take responsibility. Okay, Kat. I'll get this train to stop. Stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What 
the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Can I get the wake the fuck, fuck up, up, man? This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. Oh, you really fu- I'm sorry, Kenny, but you fucking- How fucking dare you? You're acting like nothing's wrong, and somebody's gotta knock some sense into you. No, you won't. Kenny, I don't want to do this. Get you to stop this. But you need to stop. Your ass I'm right, honestly, Kenny, you can't keep running like this. Because it's not helpful, and you're not helping anyone be like this. Don't make me fucking regret it. Shit. Oh, fuck. Just leave me the fuck alone! I don't need you, and Doc doesn't need you! Kenny, you fucking cunt. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Kenny. You're in denial of your son dying. I'm sorry. You need to stop the train. Because next time like that won't save your son, it will just get us all killed. It's happening. What are we we can't do? prevent it. We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... What if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can he just give him? Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. I'll do it. No. It should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. I'm gonna put down a duck. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Honestly, Cam, Clem. 
gonna take care of Duck. I thought he was going to die. Putting out, out I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are. What the? No! Ben, Shit. take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Please. No, she didn't. She couldn't have. Please. She did. Get! Get! Gotcha! Hi, Mum. Why, Cat? Honey. Oh, oh fucking God. God. <laughs> I've heard a report this episode twice before. Oh, my God. And my name's interrupted twice. Hi. I know. What's your name? Here okay? Yeah. Okay, well. She does this every time I'm recording, she comes in. Every time. And I don't get any privacy. Second time, uh, third time I've actually recorded this. Not part of dying, actually, because that's just fucked. Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. We got to we got to the train. And then we started exploring. So I knew about the pencil in and the RV and everything. But she does this a lot. Duck. I'm sorry. Goodbye, duck. He's losing. He's lost. Well, he's lost everyone. In one day, Kenny has lost everyone. Well, he's lost his family. He's got me, Ben, well, Lee, Ben, Clem, and then the homeless dude. What reasons you had for doing it? No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. No, oh, she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? How? Who the fuck is I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Uh. We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. The shore. Sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map of the pier. I give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you, it won't. If it were, 
You gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not That's a barber. Cool. Ain't gotta be styled, Jesus. You gotta run around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. And Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Be safe up here. You betcha. Dick. Alright. He seems like a, a lovely guy. But you can't be saying to a little girl that she's going to die. Best. Lost his wife to suicide. Lost his son. Oh, alcohol. It's all whiskey. I'll be going for that. Thank you. It's a fifth of whiskey. They look clean enough. Okay, Clem. We're going to cut hey, your hand. Come on. Did you talk to him? And give you I did. Box. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not going to let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're going to figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. You need to learn to protect yourself, Clem. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. The aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end you with your target. To shoot again. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles. But you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Come on, Clem. Teach you how to use a gun. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do that I was have very to? down to the left. Yeah, you do. Uh, a bit to the right. Okay, a little higher. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Another bottle. That was up left, so... Aim more to the right. Aim more to the right, and lower. Aim lower. There you go. Nice! One more bottle. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. 
I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. And Clem, we need to trim your hair. Hey, Clem. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Uh -huh. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Yeah, I killed Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Clementine, you are going Mind to go if we go, do this now? Going to go bold. I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. Do you know how to do this? Uh, yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Well, good. Good? Means you know when someone's lying to you. Which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with some. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah, Lily gave them to me for sleeping. I suppose Lily was actually nice or something. There, all set. Save a bitch. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Okay, your hair is a lot safer now. That's good. Okay, um... Kenny. We should probably... Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left? Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude, if he sticks around. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah. I guess not. See you. Yeah. Okay, um, Kenny, I have some booze for you. I don't want to drink in it and then go and drink. I'll give it to I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Go on. Sure. Ooh. Not known for its finish. No kidding. <clears throat> Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Kenny will, most likely. Kenny's been through a lot. So he will. Kenny. Hey, man. You and me, we... Oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. He's got whiskey. He's whiskey. Yeah, he's yeah. gone. 
That'd help. He's gone for the whiskey. Ooh, a map. I'll be taking a map. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, Clem, we need to talk. I've got a map. It was me. Huh? What? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? Holy shit. It's all my fault. Why? What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend. That he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. Jesus Christ, Ben. Clem, let's look at the map. Fucking hell. Ben's fucked up. Go on then. Go to Clem. Ben's just hey, Clem. fucked here. Well, Hi. Basically. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. Find a house. <laughs> we live in it. Find a boat. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay and, well, if they're not, what happened to them. I'm sure they're okay. I think I heard them die. I'm not yeah, choosing it's that. Best to stay positive. That's what Dad That's just always fuck. says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure Imagine out where they were, we can start there. Eight year old. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing that. on the tracks to hold us up. I think I heard your parents yeah, die. Good chunk of savanna here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's uh. Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M. M. something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Yeah. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody. Oh shit! What's happening here? Unhinged. That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. You don't want to become like Lily. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but no, we could probably unhinged. deal with that. We got a goddamn train. Thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's going to explode. You got to get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're gonna get your face chewed off. 
You guys gonna be trouble? Oh, hello. Because we could have just kept walking. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. It will be okay, Kenny. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Come on, Lee. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? Omid We're driving. Krista. Oh, man. Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Clem oh, shit! Doing? God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I, uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Kenny's lost his wife and Kenny kids. lost his wife and kid. Man. Kid, I mean... How long ago? What time is it? I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. The train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay, um... Yeah, uh... Might end it at about here. As we've got a train. We have... Some new people, Omid and Krista. With us. That's about oh, the yeah. only useful thing in here. What's this? We have, we it's have empty. Omid and Krista. And we are stuck with a tanker. But yeah, if you did enjoy, please leave a like, subscribe. And that will be it. Bye bye.